Hi, I'm Guy Avon, staff reporter with Real Change. Hello, my name is Carolyn Bick. I'm a writer for the South Seattle Emerald, and I am proud to be the 2022 Editorial Excellence Award winner. What does this award mean to you? So honestly, when Ashley told me about it, I was really, I was so shocked and excited. Oh, forgive me. I'm fangirling a little bit, but um, it's it just, I, I respect real change news so much. And it just like, it meant, it means a lot. How did you get started as a journalist? So I actually got started as a journalist a bit by accident. I was looking for something to do in an extracurricular sense in college and joined the paper there. So I first started writing for the South Seattle Emerald back in 2018. I started on a more full-time contractual basis with the Emerald in 2020 when the pandemic first hit because I became the Emerald's dedicated uh, SARS-CoV-2 COVID or COVID-19 writer. I didn't ever envision doing police accountability work. Um, and especially not the kind of accountability work I am doing. And that was also kind of an accident back when the George Floyd protests started in 2020. Oh, my work is focused on police accountability, but specifically in the realm of accountability system accountability. So I specifically write stories about the Office of Police Accountability the Office of Inspector General, and the Community Police Commission. When you talk about police accountability, what does that mean to you? Police accountability isn't just holding the police accountable. It is holding accountable all of the various leaders in many shapes and forms who are part of that system. It means holding them accountable too for their actions and decisions. Really, I'm really, for the most part, not seeing any support from larger media outlets that have the resources to do it. Like, I can't do this stuff alone, but somehow I am, <laughs> is that the agencies I mentioned, uh, as well as the Seattle City Council, as well as the mayor's office, especially now under Mayor Bruce Harrell, uh, and the Seattle City Attorney's Office make it very difficult to get information that I'm looking for even basic public information. What keeps me going when I'm actually doing my work, that someday they will help somebody. And that is what keeps me going. That is what is so important to me. Um, yeah, I see sometimes under your Twitter replies, um, Pulitzer for Carolyn. <laughs> so I wonder if we need to start a campaign. <laughs> Do 